Here's an unboxing here from Cigar.com. I got quite a bit right in here. I'm going to open this box right here. Let's just open it. Start with a set that costed thirty-nine dollars. Thirty-nine dollars for fifteen of these, right here. It was a set, and the label indicated that these were um, that they were the old label, but I guess they came like this instead. I guess they're the same ones as these but the picture showed a little bit different these look right but these ones had an older the older look to them but I guess they're the same cigar after all product of Honduras but they both look the same that's kind of funny it is it's supposed to have a brown label a simpler brown label for these but it didn't come like that now I have the Gurkha Park Avenue. Six of these for about, let me see the receipt here. I have the Gurkha Park Avenue for, I think it was $19.99. I'm not sure for these. Wait, hold up. Let me see. I had a nice conversation on the phone with the woman before I bought. She was very patient. She wanted to answer all kinds of questions and all that. Wow, what's this? $49.99 for all box and that. Not my deal. I got a magazine underneath here too. Huh. Okay. here. $100 wine voucher. See, they send things to you like this. How to spend you $100. Huh. $19.99 for Gurkha Park Avenue, which is, this is like a Connecticut <clears throat> Maduro. Three of each. Take advantage of the deals, because I'm not going to have these again, probably. Park Avenue Torpedo, though, in Toro. Very good, right here. But from the last set, Puros Indios, Five Rothschild. These are a very good smoke. I know this is a very good company. The Puros Indios is Rolando Reyes. Very good tobacco maker. Very good tobacconist, I should say. This company. Same company as this. Just backtracking on this. These are very nice right here. Grand Toro, Cabinet Maduro. Yep. It's the same in a small size. So I got 10 of those same ones, technically. And then... What's in this one? Oh, yes. This is the one. Raymond Busso. The Raymond Busso series. This is the... Uh, it say Rambuso Pass. It's the Tasters Kit, is what this is. The Tasters series. It's on, they give you two of each, like as a taste. You know, Raymond Busso. This is a definite, it's supposed to be a very good tobacconist, right here. Look at these cigars. This was like $24.99 for six of these, right here. Not a bad price given the quality, right here. Look at the labels, huh? Very nice labels on these. You know, 
supposed to be like a league of provider, you know. I bet you they're better. But they're on that idea, you know. Uh, and then we have, last but not least, five singles that I also bought here. Five singles that I bought. Let's analyze these ones. Alright, I'm going to analyze them. Okay. We have the red label. In torpedo. This is comparable to a Davidoff. Right here. Red label by Cigar.com. It's a store brand, $6. And that's a Bolivar right there. Bolivar. Uh, I don't have all the labels on. Bolivar Cofradia Robusto right there. Yeah, Cofradia. It's a Bahia Blue Brazil. That's a big ass Toro and Torpedo right there. Toro and Torpedo. A Herencia Cuban of $4 for that. This one was around 4 too. It's supposed to be really good right here. Well, Herencia Cubana. Right there. Very good. And this is the Victor Sinclair Bohemian Oscuro. Bohemian Oscuro. Uh, and. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, and then this is, yeah, I pretty much mentioned all those, but this is my set. It was like around $130 or something, I would imagine. I should be done for a while with all this buying. So we'll find out and see, huh? There is higher quality in these, so I would imagine they would take a little bit of a longer time to smoke. Um, so... I'm going to start putting these away now. Talk to y'all later, everyone. Cigar.com.